This eel lines its home with its own slime. Yeah, a mucus insulated burrow. So its skin doesn't scrape off. Meet the ribbon eel. Long, neon, scaleless, no armor plates, no protective coat, just bare skin that would get shredded by shifting sand and rubble. So it hacks the problem with biology. It secretes mucus and paints the inside of its tunnel. Why? Because ribbon eels live half in, half out, like a periscope with teeth. They ambush prey from the doorway, sand, tiny rocks, grit. That mucus lining turns sharp, grinding sand into something more like a slip and slide. Less friction means fewer cuts. Fewer cuts means fewer infections and parasites. And the mucus helps the tunnel keep its shape. So the ceiling doesn't crumble when the eel breathes or lunges. Watch how they flare those wide jaws and fancy nostril flaps. That's a come here little fish lure at the mouth, while the rest of the body stays safe in the slime coated bunker. Cool side note, they change color as they age. Young ones, black with a bright yellow fin. Adults, electric blue with yellow highlights. Biggest females, mostly yellow. Same species, different paint jobs, same slippery home design. Think about the engineering here. If you have no scales, armor the environment instead of the body. Build the runway, then glide. Waxing a surfboard, oiling a hinge, reduce drag, reduce wear, go faster, last longer. So next time you see a ribbon eel peeking from a hole like a neon ribbon come to life, remember that glossy tunnel isn't just dirt, it's custom-coated, eel-grade, anti-sand tech. Gross? A little? Genius? Absolutely. Nature ships with the best hacks.